beautiful Sunday. We're going to, uh, well, I'm going to go get some Filipino food, just like last week. Only difference is this time we're going to try out that, uh, that Max Miles bag. I'm going to fill it up with some food for tomorrow, for lunch, for work, and uh, we're going to see how much I can carry in it. I don't know, I'll just see if it was worthwhile the, the purchase for it. Beautiful day. Just tooling around. Um, it does look like some storm clouds there. I don't know. If it rains, it rains. Uh, I'm really not worried about it anymore because, well, we've already figured out last week that the bike, well, it's rainproof, waterproof. So I'm not worried about it too much. We'll see how that goes. New seat on here, it's like sitting on a cloud. Literally is, this memory foam on this uh, Cloud 9 would recommend 100%. 100%. Recommend. I uh, got a blinking light for the back of my bike, but I just noticed it's blocked when I put the bag on. So it kind of defeats the purpose, so I'm going to have to try and figure out where I'm going to put that blinky light. Other than that, fine day to be out and about. And, uh, you know, I mean, the whole idea is to be visible to all the drivers. <coughs> oh, God. Ate another gnat. I put an order in for uh, some, uh, some street tires. Just to see how that helps with the rolling, um, the rolling uh, of, of the wheels. Maybe gain another mile per hour or so here. You know, these... Uh, I mean, I barely go in the dirt, so having mountain bike tires on here kind of defeats the purpose. This is more of an urban assault bike than anything else. Oh yeah, it definitely looks like that's good. <laughs> Another repeat of last week here with the storm clouds over there. At least these th this time it's, uh, it's really visible. Last time it wasn't at all. Beautiful day out in Florida. We'll talk more as we get closer. So a little interesting thing I noticed here. When I start off on uh, from a dead stop, it seems like. Well, let's do it right here. So we'll, 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 we'll drop down here a little bit here. I'll bring it down to, oh, let's see. All right. So I'll go ahead and pop it back on here. Oh, picture my, my grandson's first time in the pool. All right, so yeah, it's popping back up to 22, 23, but I noticed earlier when I uh, when I uh, started from a dead stop, it, it only went up to 20 miles per hour, and uh, pedal says five. It's supposed to go up to 23, 24, right? So uh, I'm like, okay, so what's wrong with that? So I popped it down to four, slowed it down, put it back up to five, and it went back over 20 miles per hour. Really weird. So uh, this is the first time I've done that particular fix, so we'll see if that corrected the issue. If not, it doesn't, but uh, I'm going to keep an eye on it. And I'm getting pelted with a little bit of rain. Just a little, just a little misting. So I'm almost to where I'm at, so that's, that's going to help out a lot here. But like I said, we've already uh, established this bike is waterproof. So, talk to you soon. And it looks like we just made it in time, because... Uh, I'm getting hit with bigger raindrops. But yeah, just on time. Just right on time. Back to my favorite Filipino place. Okay, so I ordered a lot of stuff to go. I didn't order anything. My usual. <laughs> I, I I come here for breakfast. 
I really because it reminds me of the breakfast my grandmother used to cook. So we got a whole bunch of stuff here. We're going to use, we're going to put that into the Max Miles bag to see what we can carry and uh, see how viable it is as a pannier bag. And uh, we're going to travel home. I, I forgot my rain cover for it. I think I forgot it. I might put it in the bag somewhere. But either way, we're going to test out how much volume we can use and how much we can fill it up. So here we go. Okay, so this is what we're working with. We got these three bags, and we're gonna put it into this little bag here. So let's figure out how we're gonna do this. We have a pannier on this side. That opens up. Ooh, we got a ring bag. How nice is that? That's where it was. Let's put in our shopao in there. It's perfectly. No worries. Let's open up the other side. Ooh, lots of space here as well. Just the exact same size. Move it over here so you can see it. And we're going to put our bread in there. And that fits perfectly. And then we have our food. That's hot. So I think we're going to put that inside here. Yep. Sir, you forget your drinks. Oh, thank you. Salama po. There. There's the lumpia. Okay. See if I can force that underneath. And I can actually. I can do this. I can move some stuff out and put it into a side pannier. Put this on top. And the great thing about this is that it um it lifts up give up space and there we go and that my friend is how we carry those bags in the pannier the max mile saddlebag great stuff alrighty we're not gonna be using this so let's try that there and there we are and we are loaded for bear we're gonna do some uh, <laughs> we're gonna do some b-roll so that's why I brought my my ram mount but there we go and we're set ready so we finish our Filipino breakfast and the question is can we get home before the rain hits hard again now <laughs> We already tried this last week, and this time, make sure I'm waterproof all the way through. So let's do this. Let's get it going. Let's try it. What's the worst that could possibly get happen? I get wet again. So here we go. Let's get going. And we're off. We've already uh, proven that the bike is uh, waterproof. It's a slight drizzle coming down, not too bad. Could be worse, but uh, it's not bad at all. This is your stereotypical sun showers here in Florida where the sun is shining and rain's coming down. When I first moved down to Florida, I was uh, started working uh, for college, I was working as a, as, a, as a waiter at a restaurant and I met one of my best friends. Actually, uh, it was more like a brother to me. Came out to that point. He became the godfather to my kids. I'm the godfather to his son. Um, and uh, I remember the very first time we went out, he had a Camaro, a convertible Camaro. We went out and 
top down, it started raining. I'm like, well, what is this? Because, you know, we didn't have this in Pennsylvania. And that's how I learned about sun showers. So every time I have a sun shower, I think of him because, uh, yeah, my buddy Norm, he, uh, he passed away a few years back. And uh, every time I get hit with a sun shower, I think of him. So thanks, Norm, again, for having the rain piss down on me as I'm riding in the rain. Thanks, buddy. I'll always remember that. So yeah, it's still raining. Uh, still raining pretty bad here. Just uh, taking our time. When I say rain, I mean it's it's sprinkling. It's nothing bad. Not like last week. So taking our time, riding home. Fun. I was gonna do B-roll. With the, with the ram mount, I don't think that's happening anytime soon. Yeah, well, maybe I might do something later. I don't know. This rain's, uh, puts a damper on the B-roll. But I am, this time, out running the storm. Because the storm is behind me, dark clouds behind me, and I'm going into the lake. And now I'm back into the light side of Florida. Well, it rained on this side too, but it's already passed. But uh, right now, we're loving the subtropical weather that's happening here. And uh, now I'm on my main road, a couple miles from home. So what's new, what's new? Oh yeah, before I left, I got a huge old package. And guess what was in that package? My 17.5 uh, amp hour battery. But uh, yeah, that opens up a huge, huge world of possibilities of where I can go, what I can do, and do my tests and all that great stuff. So yeah, so finally got that battery. Thanks, friend. I appreciate it. I wish you guys uh, communicated a little bit better, but in the grand scheme of things, I got my bike really fast. I got a great bike, uh, you know, slight problems here and there, but nothing that I can't live with, uh, live with, live or with or without. So the end of the day i'm just happy being out on a bike and being able to ride and with my right knee being injured right now can't really pedal as much as i'd like to so having an electric uh, motor to push me around that's uh man there's just no words that just helps out immensely so i'm signing off you guys enjoy your weekend i hope you guys enjoy the rest of your sunday take care and i'll talk to you guys soon